Uh, so we have Dr. Vihil B. Shah with us and I'm going to ask very few questions to him that will interest all of you. So the first question to you, sir. Uh, so how was your experience delivering a talk at Pirata Delhi 19? Uh, should I just take this or? Okay. Okay. Uh, it, it, was, it was a great experience. Uh, I think uh, there were a lot of very... Um, uh, uh, a lot, lot of very highly motivated, uh, you know, folks out here at the conference, and uh, you know, I, I think I had a wonderful time. The volunteers have been fantastic. All the arrangements have been great. So I think it's a pretty well-run conference. So, uh, do you like the energy of the conference? It's a, it's a, it's a very high-energy conference, and I'm, I'm hoping that my talk will have convinced uh, more people to, to look into Julia as a result of, of that energy. Yeah. I'm sure about that. So, if you have to specify one thing about Pirata Delhi that you love the most, what would it be? Oh, that's a, that's a tough one because I think I have no complaints. I, I think I've, I've, I've loved everything about the conference. I, I find, actually, let me, you know, I find that uh, it's a very good grassroots conference where everyone's here because they really want to learn and, and, and get better, whether it's a student or a professional. And I, I feel that, uh, you know, that grassroots level energy uh, and, you know, that drive to sort of get better, learn more and contribute back to the open source community is, is, is something that I think uh, makes PyData Delhi really work. That's, that's what I felt out here, yeah. So did you attend any other talk, someone else's talk? Uh, I, was, uh, I was just attending the talk right after mine, but I was, I was a bit late, so I don't know, you know which talk it was, but... Uh, you know, I, I think all the talks look pretty interesting. So, um, is there any feedback that you would like to give to Pyrita Delhi team? Um, I my my suggestion would be, you know, having run a conference, that you know, that that running the conference uh, on time is a good thing. And uh, I I understand in India we always like to do things on the later side of the day, <laughs> but uh, but I think that that makes it uh, better for everyone overall. So, uh, do you have... Yeah, this is by no means a complaint, I think it's yeah. just a suggestion. Yeah. And, uh, like, do you have a message? Like, if you have to give an advice to all the Julia users, or to be Julia users, yeah. what would it be? Um, you know, it just... Uh, what's my message to Julia users, or, or would-be Julia users? You know, one of the things that has made Julia uh, what it is today is that people start out, you know, with, you know, they have their existing code in Python or R or, 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 or any other system. And then it's not fast enough. And then they start with Julia and then they write a high performance code. And then what happens is that they start digging into the packages and they figure out, oh, that package maybe could use a little bit more work or a new feature. And then they start hacking the package. And then they're like, oh wait, but this package could be better off if the standard library was a little better or the language was a little better. And so people start out as being completely new to Julia and then some of them actually go all the way and become like core com contributors to Julia itself. And that would be my message that, you know, uh, you know, jump in without any fear and, uh, and, and you know, just, just keep dig digging in and, and contributing back and uh, you'll find that the community is very welcoming. Um, and uh, very inclusive and uh, we'd, we'd like to just keep making it better thank you so much sir for your time okay. yeah okay, yes thank you.